Hello and welcome, I'm Arumba. Thank you for joining me. Let's talk about hotkeys in EU4. So first off, F1 can be used to pull up your main interface and then keyboard's shortcuts 1, 2, 3 across the top bring you across all the top columns, all the way over to 0, which pulls up the military shortcut. Next we have QWERTY, which is six keybinds, Q, W, E, R, T, and Y, which can be customized to any of the map modes that you'd prefer to have. So whichever order you'd like them, you can have it specialized just for your playstyle. Next is A. A is a keyboard shortcut that will allow you to attach a ground-based unit to a, sh uh, a ship if there are units in port. So A can attach them to transport. S is used to split an army. This will split an army right down the middle if there are multiple units um, or multiple types of units. For instance, if you have a mix of infantry, cavalry, and artillery, it will try to maintain that ratio. So if there's you know, 4 to 1 versus 2 to 1, it will maintain that regardless of how, how many different types of units there are. The D key is used to detach a siege or to detach a blockade. This will leave behind one unit usually a heavy ship or if there are none available a galley in the inner Mediterranean areas or just a transport it will leave behind a single unit to maintain a blockade or if you're sieging it will leave behind just enough men to stage a successful siege if you have no artillery it will leave behind at least enough infantry to cover the garrison if you do have artillery it will try to leave behind an ideal amount so for instance 1000 infantry and one artillery would take care of this province. The F key can be used to find possible provinces or to go to your capital. You can also use the home key on your keyboard to take you directly to your home capital. G is used to combine armies. So if you have two armies selected you can press the G key to combine or merge. Same thing with ships. It will merge all selected ships. The Z key can be used to select just the infantry in, a, in, a, in an army. So for instance, if we just want to grab this army and grab all the infantry out and then take them somewhere else, we can do that by using the Z key. X will select just your cavalry. If you have artillery, C can be used. You can also just left click here if you prefer to use the mouse. On ships, it's a tiny bit different. Z selects heavy ships. X selects light ships. C selects galleys, and V will select transports. V can also be used to select your unit building interface. This allows you to build units visually instead of having to click on a county and then select recruit regiment. The B key does the same thing except for buildings. The L key brings up your ledger. F10 will take a screenshot of the current map mode and save it as a .pg, uh, .png file in your Documents folder in the Paradox Interactive folder. F11 will take an actual screenshot of the game. And that does it for hotkeys. Plus and minus can be used to slow and uh, increase the game speed, and space can start, uh, part, pause and start. So thanks for watching. See you soon.